So guys, what's up? I was very much so planning on filming on my Sony A7 and melting that, but I'm gonna do more of a vlog style approach. I am filming on my brand, well, it's not brand new. I actually got it refurbished, so it's quite cheaper, but I've inspected it and there's nothing that I can see wrong and I'm really liking it. It's the new, well, my new, new to me, Canon G7X Mark II. Got the screen flipped up in vlog mode. It's absolutely beautiful and stunning. The image stabilization on this thing is awesome. The ISO, the lighting, how much it lets in, the the f-stops, the aperture, the color, just the picture in general, the autofocus, the face recognition, the touch screen. When I first got this thing, that's what I first did, I was like turn it on just start poking stuff. Like I was able to like turn it on, flip up the screen, and then just poke on my face and now it tracks me. And it's awesome. This thing is so cool. Not only that, but it's like thick. It's like heavy duty and durable. It like looks and feels like a really nice camera. Like my old Sony HX80, Handy little thing, tiny, but did not feel, I mean, it felt flimsy. It felt, it felt good, but it felt like a, like a small, like cheap digital camera. This thing feels like professional grade. It feels like awesome. It just feels heavy and strong. I don't know. Call me crazy. But, but, today we're going to be talking about five reasons I use YouTube. So guys, five reasons I use YouTube, and I'm just going to do this super organically, super off the top of my head. I have nothing planned out to say. We'll see what happens and comes up first because I think that'll truly be from, from the heart. Number one is how to do stuff. I think everyone does that, but YouTube is like my go-to for learning stuff. Like, you have a car problem, boom, YouTube. Something mechanical or something electronical breaks down, boom, YouTube. How do I do something on my computer? Boom, YouTube. How do I edit? Boom, YouTube. How do I do a double backflip somersault spring 280 no scope 360 kill? Boom, YouTube. Number two, other workouts, like figuring out other programs, like doing research on stuff, seeing what other people are doing, how they're doing it, what they're getting into, diets that they're accompanying their routines with, results expected, stuff like that, I guess. Um, for a lot of science stuff, so like learning about supplements and workout stuff, I would say YouTube is really good for that. That's another reason I use YouTube. Number three, and I'm going to say this, I don't do it as much, but the biggest thing I used to use YouTube for, especially back in the day, was music. I would get home from school, I'd pop open with this big, like, I forget what the brand of it was. It was like big red head flames. It was a gaming laptop that my dad had bought us back in like 2008, the thing had wicked speakers on it. I'd pop that sucker open, just hit shuffle play on YouTube. I'm talking Red Hot Chili Peppers, Blank Way 2, Green Day, anything like really like that kind of stuff. I uh, would just rock out to that music, rancid, stuff like that, and just do my homework or talk to girls on Facebook and MySpace. But yeah, so YouTube for it was definitely a huge thing for music for me. Number four for YouTube, I'm gonna say entertainment, and I guess this might fit in with music slightly, but I mean differently, like it's not necessarily just music, but like stuff about certain video games or certain topics. I definitely like watching about Dragon Ball Z or different theories or people debating certain topics on like, you know, certain shows or animes or making funny things about it like memes or I know there's this K-Mac guy right now from Scotland and he's just doing these hilarious videos that have to do with metal and if anyone knows me when I'm at like work or just like singing along to a song, all of a sudden I'll just break out in a breakdown and I'm like, here comes the sun and just go absolutely nuts. Like, um, I think he's hilarious so you guys should check him out. I'll leave a link to his channel below, I guess. Yeah, if you guys like funny stuff and metal and music memes, and he's definitely one of them. But yeah, so meme lore, stuff like that, Filthy Frank, entertainment, really. So that's going to be my fourth reason is entertainment. And then finally, my fifth reason I watch YouTube is to get ideas for my YouTube and also to enjoy my friends' YouTube videos. I think it's really fun to watch other people create stuff, especially maybe if it's not even something I'm interested in, but maybe it's something I can become interested in, and maybe it's stuff that my friends are doing that they're passionate about, and I want to support them in that. 
So maybe not necessarily something I'm into, but maybe I don't know if I'm into it or not because I've never tried it, but it, maybe they're into it. And even if I know I'm not into it, then I can support them in doing that. And that is a good feeling, helping each other out. So there you have it, five reasons why I watch YouTube. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. Thank you so much to Classic Physique Fitness for tagging me in this. I almost forgot, he tagged me out like a week or two ago, but I didn't get around to doing this, I was just too busy. I'm going to tag RC Martinez and yeah, so five questions, five reasons why you watch YouTube. I don't know if he's already done this yet, but I'll reach out to him, make sure he knows. So thanks guys, as always, stay positive, take it easy. Praise Jesus, stay natty, Team Natty out.